Have you ever wondered how big the Worthington Diamond Mine is? We're located just a short distance outside of Southwest Arkansas's famous Crater of Diamond State Park, and we own this 10 acre plot. It used to be a forest like the trees you see back there, but now uh, we had a clear cut and got all the stumps out of the way so we could expose the lamperite here. And the lamp, although we have 10 acres, the lamperite is only about one acre. And I say only about, an acre is about the size of a football field. So if you see all this mown area here where we had the bush hog in here last week, the ground magnetic survey says all of this has lamperite under it. Now we don't know how much overburden, maybe 12 feet, we don't know. But over here, there was only three to four feet of overburden. So it was less expensive to get to the diamond bearing ore and it was closest to where diamonds had been found in the past. We have record that on the other side of that fence, 80 feet, um, 12 of the 17 diamonds on this adjoining property were found just 80 feet across that fence line. So anyway, we started digging here rather than digging down here because it's a, we don't know how much overburden and uh, we wanted to be closer to where diamonds have been found in the past. So that's why we're excavating this spot. And uh, um, as you see to the left, there's more overburden. The, the deposit seems to take a dive. So maybe you know, as we get farther, we'll have more overburden to remove. But anyway, we got no problem with that right now. Everything you see exposed right there, the pile and everything under that, that is raw virgin lamperite uh, diamond bearing ore. And we're going to process that. So all we have to do is dig it, haul it, wash it. Thanks for joining me on this beautiful September afternoon in 2022.